Road accidents caused by distracted or speeding drivers are a huge risk for the more than 135,000 men and women of the waste collection industry who are out in force each day helping to keep communities clean and healthy. While drivers understand that they're required by law to slow down when they see a school bus or emergency vehicle, not all states mandate that drivers be cautious around garbage trucks. Here to tell us about a very important new national safety campaign developed by waste companies aimed at putting an end to tragic road accidents are Phil Hagen. He is the Director of Safety with the Environmental Industry Associations, and Sharon Kinnies, who is the President and CEO of the Environmental Industry Associations. Welcome to you both. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. Thank you. Uh, this is very important, so let's dig right in. Tell us why waste collection is such a dangerous profession. You know, every day... Thousands of dedicated men, or women, men and women are in our communities collecting trash and doing this important work. And they do it in a dangerous environment. It's dangerous because they are on the road along with reckless, uh, distracted, and impatient drivers. And we want to be partners with the public to make it safer for these men and women to get their job done and to return home safely to their families. So what we, we want to encourage is slow down to get around. Can you tell us, are there any states out there that currently have legislation and kind of what's being done to, to make it uh, illegal to, to be reckless around these vehicles? Absolutely, yes. There are three states that have legis currently have legislation in place. Michigan, Alabama, and just recently Wisconsin. Pennsylvania is currently working on legislation that we hope will be codified into law sometime in the near future. We support efforts throughout the country to, and encourage voters to support this type of legislation no matter what state they're in. This is a very important part of our program going forward. It is indeed a huge issue that needs to be addressed. Tell us a little bit now about your Slow Down to Get Around campaign and uh, what caused it to come about. Slow Down to Get Around is a national campaign that was developed by the industry uh, when uh, workers, one worker was uh, killed, unfortunately, and another seriously injured. Uh, and we uh, couple this campaign uh, with public service announcements and additional information, including placards on, on trucks. And you may often see the slow down to get around decal on, on waste collection trucks. Can you tell us, uh, again, as drivers, what are some of the things that you're encouraging people to do to ensure the safety of waste collection employees? We encourage people not to be impatient, to take their time getting around trucks, to watch out for people. If you see a stopped truck somewhere, that means there's a person collecting a container of, of trash somewhere. You need to watch out for that person. We also feel that the distracted driving aspect of it is a big problem. Talking on a mobile phone, texting while driving, these lead to serious consequences around garbage trucks. And as, uh, and as we're approaching the back to school season where uh, drivers are encouraged to be cautious around school buses, we'd like them to add an additional note of caution to be, to be cautious around waste collection trucks as well. It's an excellent point. Before we let you go, tell us uh, where everyone can go for more information about this program please go to WasteRecyclingSafety.com. All right, Phil Hagen, Sharon Kinnies with the Environmental Industry Associations. Thank you for spending a few minutes with us today. Thank Thanks. you for the opportunity. Absolutely. Thank you very much.